Good afternoon or good evening everyone. Hillcat Granny here. This is Monday, the day after things after Thanksgiving, the Monday after Thanksgiving. Isn't this a beautiful view? Look at that sky, the sunset. It is beautiful. I came here to get some gas. I just checked with one of the dealerships here to see what they might give me for this Rubicon 392. And I was not very impressed. The guy did not even come and talk to me. He said, well, it was locked, so he didn't check the interior. He didn't check to see about the um, automatic steps, anything about the vehicle. Did not have the courtesy to even come and say hi or bye. I'm going to check your vehicle. Just said, well, it was locked, so he couldn't see it. Well, I do not leave my vehicles unlocked. I don't care where I am unless I am standing right outside the vehicle. And they have you wait inside. So I wasn't impressed. So I will come up with another plan, either keep it or find someone else that might be interested in buying it. See what what happens there are other other places around. And I can always keep this beauty. I really enjoy driving her. She's easy to and nimble. versatile. My only problem is trying to use it for traveling. It doesn't have enough interior space for me to have a, a bed and the conveniences I want. I think that's a little bit awkward, but I might be able to adjust to it or take the seats out or something. There are ways to overcome different problems. I was hoping to have another solution. I was hoping I'd be able to purchase that Honda Odyssey van that I gave my granddaughter. She doesn't need it anymore. Um, but that that isn't going to work out. And actually, I think I'm done with that. That was That's history now. And there are bound to be better solutions for me. And I can always keep on like I am keeping on. But this is, is such a pretty evening. So I thought I'd just do a little bit of cruising. I had about half a tank of gas, I decided while I was in the vicinity to just stop and fill up pump it off. And now the sky is so pretty. Ooh, come on over here. Since traffic is such that I can do that, I believe I'm going to see if I can find a better unobstructed view without so much traffic. I haven't explored out in here, so I may just do that. I'm on Milwaukee, which at one time there wasn't anything on this street when I moved here. There might have been one or two things. I, not very much, and it is really built up. So I believe I will try this street and see what where it takes me. Hopefully, there's not much has been built up out there. Although I know that major, I mean major, not ma, not little housing 
developments are taking place in Lubbock, major ones. I don't know if you can see over there, all of that is housing. It may be too dark to see. sunset real quick and there's not much traffic going that way can you see that isn't that beautiful it is and of course now we're going south so we can't see that we can still see a little bit of the pink in the clouds and so on. There's more housing over there too. I'm afraid if I go down all the way where I, I know there's pretty views, the sun may have already set by then. Of course, I guess that we can deal with that too. I hope everyone had a nice Thanksgiving. Whatever you do, if you celebrate Thanksgiving or don't let's celebrate Thanksgiving. I believe every day should be a Thanksgiving day. I appreciate what I do have. Of course, I don't always do that. I do like this, look at this, I do like this time of day. I hope it is showing up reasonably well for you. Of course, we have traffic here in Lubbock. It is getting heavier. I don't even know for sure where I am. Oh, I'm on Upland, apparently. I need to get out and do more exploring around Lubbock. And since it looks like I'm going to be keeping this Rubicon and trying to come up with uh, other alternatives for her, we can do more exploring. Oh, I could get on the Marsha Sharp Freeway. We may just do that. See how that is for a sunset. It's been a very nice day today. It's been in the 60s today. Over the weekend, they had said you were going to have winter storms. Well, none of that materialized. No snow. We had some rain. Nothing like storms or snow, for sure. Yeah, I stopped at the railroad tracks. I don't like to get close to those intersections. They have some major accidents in some of these major intersections where the loop and the various major things come about. 
as people come on and off. And when I say major, we can have some major accidents where people actually are severely injured in deaths, which is sad here in town. So we will go this way. Oh, yes. Well, that has us heading well. Of course, I will need to pick up speed a little bit to go. It looks like the traffic is fairly heavy getting on the Marsha Sharp. in Wolfers. Wow. And there's a big Brahms. In fact, I believe the Brahms that's on our right is the largest Brahms in Texas. Could be and elsewhere too. I haven't even been in that, so I would like to go in there sometime but it's very expensive to eat out but see isn't that a beautiful sunset just ignore all the obstacles in the way <laughs> all the signs and street lights and deals the traffic Very nice community. Maybe 
maybe I should look and see if they have any homes for sale that I might be interested in and get a little further out of Lubbock. is just so gorgeous. Of course, the phone isn't really picking up all of the bright colors, but I believe you have a pretty good idea of how it looks. A little further up is where Hometown Tires is, and they are very good people there. I really love doing business with them, coming out just to visit with them. Then a little ways past that is an RV dealership that I really like. I believe that they are very honest and do a good job. They've taken care of my RV. I spoke to someone that might be interested in buying my RV. That might be a better option for me than selling this 392. I am not sure. Of course, there are always options. And when one door closes, another opens. Right here is the RV dealership. Yes, PM Performance. I'm very pleased with them. They're very, seem to be very conscientious. Take pride in their work. And they have some amazing vehicles there, which are far out of my price range. I really need things that are small. I don't need large, large vehicles anymore. Oh, I am glad I was able to show you the gorgeous sunset we have here. I'll let you see a little bit of Wolfers. This isn't the residential area to some of the business area but it's a very nice community I believe I need to check it out see if this would be some place I would be interested in there's hometown tires great people oh they're still open they're working on more vehicles. No. Well, it's almost six o'clock. Let's see, am I right? I believe there's a really great restaurant over here, a Mexican restaurant. Oh, I do love Mexican food. That is, it's worth eating out for Mexican food. That's good Mexican food. It's time to head back to Lubbock and go home, feed my dog, check on her. I am so blessed to have such a wonderful dog. I have a great family. Don't think they always want to claim me. That's all right. There is some water from some of the recent rain. We certainly needed the rain. So I'm going to wish everybody a great evening. Have a sunshine.
sunshine kind of evening and life. And I will talk to you later. Later, later. Wonderful day.